Jay here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I just wanted to quickly show you guys another storage solution I came up with for my December daily kit and really for that matter, any project that you're working on. Um, so if you have been following along with any of my recent videos, you would have seen these little bobbins. I got these for um, some Happy Mail that I sent off. And when I was creating the Happy Mail and making little bobbins full of um, baker's twine and things like that, it occurred to me that these would be excellent for washi tape. So um, I've already dismantled my washi rings, but in some of my other videos for my December daily kit and my storage, you would have seen, or I will make sure to link them, um, that I keep all of my washi on these big rings uh, in my December daily kit. So these are many of the rolls of washi. And I can take all of this and make it into something like this. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and just um, take some of my washi off of the rolls and make them into little tiny washi um, to-go cards. I don't know what else to call these. So, um, but basically being able to take all of these rolls that didn't work. You get my point here. Take all of those beautiful rolls of washi. Or I can take that. So um, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and just show you guys a quick fast forward version of what I'm doing just to give you an idea of how much washi I'm adding to each one of these. The other thing I wanted to point out and I'll be sure to include lots of photos if it warrants. I mean, this is a pretty simple thing, but like these thinner washies here, I was able to include multiple washies on one of these little bobbins. So that is also really cool because now I don't have to carry, you know, three where the other one is, but um, I basically eliminated one whole roll of washi out of my kit. So I am pretty excited about this. So I will go ahead and fast forward and um, unless I need to come back in and share anything else with you guys, I probably will just leave it there and show you guys the final result at the end. And that's it. Pretty quick and simple. But these bobbins, um, I should tell you that I got them, I got a whole package of them uh, at Hobby Lobby and I think I paid 99 cents for them. I don't know how many there were because I've gotten rid of the packaging, but um, there's quite a few, so I'm going to guess maybe 25. I, I could count them, but you get the point. Cheap, cheap, cheap for quite um, quite a few there. So, And then what I'll end up doing is I'll just stick them all onto a ring. So I have just purchased another load of these 2-inch binder rings. These ones are the 2 inches. And, I mean, come on. I am super excited about this. I mean, it's such a simple little thing, but this is this is a big deal for me because I'm trying to minimize how much stuff I put in my kit and this is gonna help significantly. So I will just fast forward so you guys can see uh, approximately how much washi I'm putting on each of these and that's that. So um, I will go ahead and get to it. So I basically just take about two feet worth of washi tape. Um, I typically don't measure, but for the purposes of showing you guys, it's about two feet. I've also created a PDF that you can download from my blog and I'll link below with a uh, paper version of the bobbin. And there's also a PNG that you can drop right into your Silhouette software and cut them out to your heart's content. So thanks again, friends, for watching my video. I hope you some, found some value here. And as always, if you liked what you saw, I would love for you to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. And then finally, don't forget to hit that little bell so you're getting notifications when new videos are posted. Thanks, friends, and I'll see you next time.